Thank you so much for joining me. This is Game Edge. We are back in the forest, all right? So we started this carport style looking. I didn't mean it's actually cars driving, but this is what it looks like, like a hotel would. Uh, and it has like a little awning on top of it. So that's it. So we actually use that with our roof. Our roof's being built over here. And again, Queen Shetty has actually said a good point that I'm actually integrating a lot of the trees and stuff into the actual game. And yes, I, I'd, I'd like to work around some of the nature parts. And that is true. It looks like this... So we've been working a lot with nature and allowing some stuff and actually working with it else and trying to take it apart every two seconds and making a hindrance. Um, some of you asked whether or not, um, you know, we can actually just go around twerk. Some of you have not seen it or haven't gone back to the other videos. They are available. You can actually go back, but we'll do a quick one because it has been a while. So we have to do it. And after that, we're going to start to finish up this base right away before we get the company. If you don't know, this is Blue Thunder. Uh, one of the best weapons ever. And we got also a tennis racket now. We've got a lot of stuff. I think we got it all, don't we? Just missing some toys and stuff. All right, so cool. This is actually the benches. Uh, right now, it's our kitchen table with our four skull lap right here. And uh, this is our bed that's caused this, but actually ended up being really nice. I thought it would look really nice. This is our kitchen sink. Get a little bit of water. Do we need any? No, we saw that full. That's good. And this is our war room right here. And this is our arrows. We can actually targets, so we can actually take our targets right out. And there we go. We can actually start shooting at it. Let's see if we can get something here been a long time I've actually done this I do pretty good at getting arms and stuff with these arrows so I should be able to get a bullseye come on I didn't hear the new breathing I don't know if it was there before oh that was way off I knew it right away when I let go jeez how many arrows will it take for edge to hit oh my god Oh, I was just breathing. Did you see that breathing up and down? I have to be a little more patient with it. All right, that's cool. Um, I didn't realize they actually integrated that in there. So this is our war room again. We have a little sink over here too, beverages. We're not finished yet to building this. There's a lot of little things I want to get done. And again, uh, skull tables and that. If you're wondering, go back and see. You'll get to see how this was built and integrated into it. So very cool. This is actually our basement here. Uh, right now, we're not going to be building anything here. We're going to supposed to be done the garden here, but because it's uneven, it's causing some issues. Um, it's, there's been issues with gardens not growing, so we're going to be doing that on the roof. That's why we've changed this up. Um, this is going to be a little Timmy's room. People were asking, this is actually the room for Timmy. It is on the ground floor. kind of sucks. Maybe he'll go upstairs or not, but it's all good. So I'm just building around here, and again, people are saying, are you? Well, you know what? Well, if I'm going upstairs, let's, let's get in, in the... Let's get used to bringing this upstairs right now. Because I like to finish this up. I like to finish the build, uh, at least for the roof part, and get it done so we can start putting our garden down. That'd be pretty freaking cool. And yeah, this is the roof. Now there's an update coming up tonight. So uh, very excited. And hopefully it's not a roof one that you know takes a couple less stones to actually do because I'd be crying. But it's been pretty cool. It's done. And this actually integrated, like I said, the table right down here. And a lot of this, some of this was inputted by, from you guys too. So... Um, again, thank you so much for being involved. I, I really like this. I like the look of this. And so far, we haven't seen any mutants or cannibals. That's pretty odd. Usually around this time of day, when you log in, it's uh, free for all. So I'm sure they'll be coming around to annoy us any moment now. There's a rock there, just in case you guys are seeing what that is. Um, oh, always make sure you go up with something, right? Man, we're going to put more rocks in these things. The sleds are empty. I don't like that. Looks nicer here, doesn't it? It really does. Yeah, our two doors, which can be locked from the, from here, so that's good. Our window here was actually a lot nicer before until the update occurred, the previous one. So I'm wondering what they're going to do with this one now. Not destroy anything, but I'm saying previous one. Uh, what they're going to be actually doing to this update, what we're going to get. Uh, are they going to be integrating this? Are they going to be making us be able to go in that big crater and find out what's in there? Uh, I'd love to know. I would really love to know what's in there. Again, we got the key pass right here, uh, which is the one that goes down. Do I still have it? I always forget where the hell it went. If that's the manifest, that's that. Did we lose it? No, it's right here. And this is the pass we saw. Somebody actually said that the symbol, the same symbol on the bottom for the Sahara there, the logo. I wish you could zoom into things when you look down, but I'll look down here. It says employee right there. So um, it brings in a little more clue for what's going on. In this game so if you're not too sure there's actually a story that's starting to unfold and it's actually pretty darn cool so can i use that as a weapon no <laughs> i mean something new to kill them with poor damn cannibals all right sorry for that swerve left right i started thinking of something else i'm going to fix that with a piece of wood or something 
kind of annoying. Yep, so main goal is to build. And again, I want to let you guys hope for. I know we do it every single time. There's so many things uh, that could come in into this. I mean, one would be a ladder. Would be, you know, God, make it a rope ladder and a wood ladder. Uh, for us to do some cool things too, I'd like to be able to build the ladders. I think it'd be cool that without the stairs, to have a ladder go up to our, our garden up here. Uh, I think that'd be pretty cool. Again, I guess we wouldn't be able to bring the logs with us. You can't really climb up the ladder with two logs. Maybe make it one log and carry up. Uh, pulley system was actually one that another people were talking about. Um, they're talking about some kind of pulley system, which I wanted to do too. Hey, how you doing? I'll be right, please hold it. I'll be right there. Just give me a second. I, I got blue thunder for you. Blue thunder is my beautiful rock that's going to smash you. Ooh, hit him. We're almost done this one. I can't believe it. We're not done this part yet. We're getting there. You know what? It's step by step. And we're going to get there. And we're going to build that fireplace right here and some uh, nice little stuff. We built a couple of fireplaces a long time ago. Uh, and again, always integrating as much as we can into this game. Uh, that piece over there, if you wonder what it is, I'm going to get to it right now. There's so many more things I want to build. It's right next to Catapult. Um, you see that roof thing here? The same kind of concept that occurred there, but I couldn't. They split up the rock pieces. And it looks like he just didn't like that he, I was coming back. He scared the shit out of him, I guess. Or he's going to get his friends and uh, shit's going to happen. Again, I hope they don't take away the rocks from us. I, I think that's going to be imperative to keep. I'd hate to see rocks disappear. They're so important uh, right now for our build. And the bottom left, you can see I need 1,400 rocks, which is about 1,100 left for here. So pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, let's get this done. Again, I'd love to see this finished, and after that, we will be building across. Uh, I'm not sure how I'm going to end uh, this slab onto the other side, uh, how we're going to use that. Uh, there's some debate of how I'm going to do it in my head, but I, was, I, I take it one time, one, one thing at a time. I need to see it, I need to feel it, sometimes play with it for a couple, and see how it turns out. It actually turned out really nice. It slants a little bit to the left, as you can see. There's nothing I really can do about that. It's the way the building is built on this, and it's slanting down. That's why it's on the floors like that. Unfortunately, when you build the custom frame, the custom of, I guess, our foundation, uh, it actually kind of slants. And it doesn't straighten out properly. Or there's problems with loads, I'm not sure. Because initially, when you build it, it looks beautiful. Everything's great. Then you reload back in, it's all corrupted. You can actually use a cutting tool to straighten this all up, too. Uh, just walk around. It won't do the stairs, but it'll do the flooring like these and make it look all nice, which is kind of cool. Let's get this done. How many are left here? Two more here. So two more across the board. Just four more logs. Wow. All right, that's cool. Then we just make the stairs. I still have a little more logs over there, so don't worry. Uh, we're not going to log this time around. We, we will. Unfortunately, we will. <laughs> Fortunately and unfortunately. I mean, sometimes you think about it, this part of the game and it's it's still very interesting i find it very fun i, I still do it quite a bit if you can see i do with all my logs i have clear cutted that area over there i try to avoid doing close by the reason why i like to keep the trees it keeps the environment looking nice and i don't want to lose the the way the, the base would look so i try and avoid as much as possible that's nice that's nice it looks like that's completely built isn't it all right cool so there's these stairs which is 17 logs and then we can start building. I think we're going to start on our gardens right after that on top. So we can actually start planting and making, uh, getting back our stuff without having to worry about that. We also need drying racks and stuff on this area here. So I don't have to run back every time over there in that little shed. Which is kind of annoying in its own way, but it's okay. Two, three, four, five. I'm so used to picking up rocks now that it's, it's like second nature. I'll drink a little bit. And a lot of people were debating with me, well, you know, you don't have to do it like this to go and play some. Uh, you do. In my own, at least my, my game, I find it a lot easier. And again, maybe it's easier for you the other way. It's all good. Uh, to each his own. I'm just showing different ways. Uh, and again, that was actually provided to me by one of the viewers too. I wish I remember all your names. I'm so sorry. There's so many of you and there's, you guys are obviously so awesome. There's so many to talk to. But yes, um, I actually mentioned his name or her name in here. So... Yeah, I would just have to crawl and do it. It makes it a lot easier to just put them in when there's too many of them. And now I'm running low on food. I can see that. They're all turning black. So I will have to start seeing when I there's actually rabbits or uh, hopefully lizards around here. I'll be able to actually go and take care of that. 
and get more. Let's get this logs done. Oop. I was talking about that, and we have to take advantage of this. Sorry, brother. My apologies. Now you can use that, uh, if you're new to this too, you can use that skin that we just got here as armor. Or you can use the bone skins, which you just, you know, right click here. Oops. Right click and control, and it brings in the stack like this, and you put three, and bam, it'll drop itself down there. So very cool to have. It's important to keep these in stock when you do it by burning the cannibal. So I know a lot of you do know that, but I just, again, we keep abreast with new players, new gamers, or getting themselves involved in this phenomenal game, um, which I, I don't blame you because it is addictive. The first time I ever saw the previews of this game, I got like in awe. And ever since that, I have been captured ever since, and that's actually the reason why I got a computer and started playing PC gaming and drop off on console. I used to have a PS4 and an Xbox One. My PS4 fried so many times I gave up to it. I gave up on it. And uh, yeah, make a long story short, that's a shelved gaming device right now. Uh, it no longer works. <laughs> I've given up on the warranties and saying back and forth. It's a it's a real shit. Uh, yeah, so uh, yeah, so I end up I have my Xbox One and this, and I pretty much don't spend time ex anything else but PC gaming, just because I find it, uh, indie gaming is a whole lot better. Just I'm having a lot of fun. It doesn't make anything bad about you guys having a console. Trust me, I don't blame you. It's expensive computers, and uh, it doesn't change. So like Seven Days to Die is going on there. This is going on. Uh, well, Subnautica went on Xbox One only, and uh, this one here is going I think on both PS4 and xbox one hopefully by the end of the year that'd be pretty cool get a little more gamers and i think it'll be a hit game right away uh for mainstream gamers on consoles so this is gonna be great i doubt that we're gonna see the naked cannibals on the actual console version i think those will be covered up without doubt. i don't think sony or microsoft are gonna allow those kind of things to occur you know if you don't come on but i mean if they want to sell it to you know to younger crowd and that's it you don't want to go rated r and you don't want it to, to not be able to sell you have to actually do that unfortunately so you know if it's kind of like national geographic style where you know if that really turns you on then brother you need to check your head because <laughs> that's some nasty nasty stuff and grand theft auto has it too so it's not like it's a something new but i guess if they want to sell it to mainstream they can actually do it it's not really a kid's game either so I don't see any five-year-olds or seven-year-olds playing this. Young adults for sure and older adults are definitely going to enjoy this. It's looking good, right? It's not going as wide as I thought it would, but it's okay. It's just a small itsy-bitsy gap. If I let go of those logs right now, everything drops to the bottom and I lose them all. There's nothing I can do about that. I wish there was. Sorry, I thought I heard something to the right. I checked really quick. I also got a new mouse pad. So uh, it's actually a Razer mouse pad. I don't know if you've ever seen these things. Uh, they're they're really quick. Ah, oh, shit. How you doing? I'm just going to hop. I'll be right back for you. I'll be right back, I said. You just gave me freaking chills. You scared the shit out of me. All right. Always, always a prima donna, these guys. Always prima donnas. Do I have any rocks in me? I don't even think so. I do. Good job, mate. How many do we have? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, let's take Blue Thunder out. Do we have any arms or legs? Yeah, let's give him a hand. Hey, buddy. Yeah, don't get hit by these things. I want you to die right now. You saw what I was going to do, huh? Your buddy didn't make it, though. Aw, oh, come on. Let me give you a hand, buddy. Oh. You've been, like, a little bit ninja on me today. Okay, this is their top athlete, obviously. Whoa. This hand is really slow. I'm not used to it. I'll have to beat you slowly. Just for what you just did. Animation was weird on that. Okay. I mean, it is weird already that we're, we're killing this guy. Slowly. It's probably the most painful death possible. It's beaten to death. 
There we go, he's down. Let's wash ourselves off, because I guarantee you that's full of blood over us. Hey, dear. Kind of need your pelt. And these are great to get rocks, and you also get some one cloth into this, so it's pretty cool. All right, we'll go back to a serious weapons now. Let's go back to a serious weapon of a uh, foot. Next one will be foot. If there's singles or doubles, I can actually take them out with this. I kind of damaged a little bit of my armor. I'm going to take a look at this. All right, we'll come back with a foot. Oh, someone wants it. Head or foot, head or foot. Uh, I'll do a foot. Unless there's more than one. Okay, he got killed. The other one running. Don't hit the trap yourself. Now these are, as soon as you hit that trap, this comes swinging down and kills you. And we'll drop him near here, like so. I'll pick up the bones we need for more armor afterwards. And we'll bring those two logs up here, which should pretty much be done for this sector that now that we're going to start adding those flower box. We will be doing the rest of it around. Um, I might rework a little bit of it, uh, the way the structure itself. I'm just trying to get flow of feeling the way this feels right now when I'm walking around and before I actually put them up. So if you're wondering why aren't you, why am I not working on that, it's because I'm actually just doing a flow right now. Sometimes I just need to feel it. If I feel like there's, you know, I'm not 110% sure, I don't want to build it all by myself and not know if it's going to look nice or not. I do spend time after putting up these kind of like ghosts that take me quite a long time to do. So, I should just put this away for now because, oh, I don't want you to lose it. Uh, do we have enough rocks? Because it's shit. I hate I need to go around this. Usually I'm prepared and I have a whole bunch of rocks everywhere, but it's okay. Part of the game. Definitely a war room is really cool. I can't wait to do that. It's like this part here. I might have to change that. It's all about the beams on that one. I want them to match out perfectly fine without having to get in the way and stuff. Fortunately, you can't do it all perfectly. So you have to try and find some kind of, you know, halfway point between both. A happy medium, as it's say, you know? Happy medium. Okay, just need one more for that one. There we go. This is horrible, this. Um, can I fix that with... It ain't the straightest of all on the top, to tell you that. All right. Is this affected at all? You can't make holes in this, right? Oh, see the lag on this? Ooh, we have to be careful of that. This actually fixed up the floor. I can actually cut holes in that. That's how I made this thing on the right. Oh, it's not a big deal. How is that broken? Yeah, I might have to make... Oh, no, it's because of stairs. That's right, I have to concept for the stairs. This is actually really nice. Hopefully we can put a little bit of gates and stuff around this. Uh, it utilizes the space pretty nice. Uh, it really changes the way it looks. We also have a bridge out there, if you're new. Uh, I use, actually use it as a diving board. Now I dive off it right into the middle of the actual lake. I've done that several times on our videos. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. All right, let's see if we can actually put some flower box up here. I'm just curious about this. Can we do it? I think so. If not, that's going to suck a lot. Um, where are the flower boxes? Under guard, there we go. Perfect, yeah, they do fit. Okay, let's try and keep them as straight as possible. I'll leave a little room for a gate over there. A closure. We'll just do it for like here so we can see. I want to leave a little room just in case I decide to close that off. I don't want the flower boxes to be in the way and not be able to destroy them. I'll turn around one time. Oh, that extra spin. There we go. Perfect. Should have done control on that one, but it's okay. One. Two. I should have done control that one, too. Uh, that way I can do three if I keep them close like that. Uh, 
I don't know how it's going to react me on an angle with this, but it's okay. We'll, we'll do our best. We'll do three for now on this and see how that works out. Unless I don't bother doing them here and I keep this for afterwards and I put them right there on the edge. I might have to think about that a little bit, actually. Like this one sticks out a little more. I'll have to do something with that. I can't cut this out, the stair. Uh, I can actually break it, though. But I think I might end up using that somehow. Actually, I'm kind of disappointed that stair being stuck out that far, especially it did show that in a ghost. If it did, I don't remember. I'll have to look back in the video, but I don't think it did. This is where I should be able to cut out pieces. What if I put a layer of rock all the way across? Always, I'll figure that out. Not a big deal. Small things, small things it is. We don't have to worry about that as much as we thought. Holy Jesus. All right. We should be seeing an attack very shortly. Now it's nightfall. And actually, you know what? I'm starting to wonder if it's attacks. As much as attacks or is that the time of day is changing. That might be the other thing. Time of day. And we got some warped up birds here. We should be able to utilize. Oops. Look at that. We get all the feathers and make arrows with those. Oh, I got jammed in. I lost that feather. Screw it. I'm not risking my life for that. Got some rocks. Let's see if we can pass the night very fast. We deserve a night of without the darkness. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, the other thing people have been asking is checking how many days we've been here in the forest. God, those sounds sound like uh, armsy and stuff coming at us. Uh, I just want to show you the stats and all that. Again, we are 17 sanity right now. They survive 255, currently feeling hungry. We're going to take care of you there. Uh, if there's any kind of infection, we'll be showing up here or here. Athleticism is now 5, and strength is 10. We're doing pretty good. We still have weight gain, and we're going upwards. Strangely enough, he's doing so much work that he shouldn't be having any weight gain. Edible. All right, see, now it's okay. It's not full. I can drop him on here. I know that. When this thing is completely full, though, can't. There's a little bit of water right there. All right. I still have a little bit to drink in here. That's all good. Okay. Those are full. What does that sound? It might be the lizards. Are they praying down there? They're not praying right now. Usually they start praying right there in a the corner. We've done a couple episodes where we actually caught them praying. Uh, and if anytime I can, I like to get close and see if there's any kind of differences with that. Uh, this is going to change too. I have to get rid of this. I can't wait to actually get this. I've tried to jump it, guys. I've tried many things uh, to get it done. We'll get done. We'll figure out a way. But this is absolutely going to look cool. I'm really digging this a lot. Yeah, that, that's really looking cool. The stair part of back, we'll deal with that. Like I said, so be it. It's life. It's life. Uh, we could probably do the gardens there. I still think the gardens probably look nice in that area I put it. It'll give a nice feel when they're growing and actually seeing from the other side. Especially if we do blueberry brushes and stuff. Yeah, I think we're going to do it. Covered in blood. One lizard and we're finally we're going to be infected. Infections will uh, bring down your athleticism and also sometimes your strength, so... Best to go in there and just dip in. Or you can swim in the water and actually remove it there too. Which is the lake over there behind me. But let's not risk it. I'm going to stick up the couple of logs we have. It's a long trek, I tell you. We have to put those baskets in there before we do that. Probably next episode. Again, we're going to have to wait to see what they bring us. Um, some goodies are coming, I'm sure. We're probably due for some goodies. Um, did I already dig something in there? I did. All right. Those are all the flowers. That's good. Do we have anything that's growing in here yet? Let's just double check to make sure we're not wasting. Uh, yeah, our aloe is still there, and it's not turning out too well at all. Seems like it loses one seed every time, so I'm not too 
sure why that's happening. We have two of them here. These are two young ones. They're not, they don't look like they're mature yet, but it's okay. This one looks like he's stuck. There you go. Perfect. That's how you make these medications and all that. We need these plants without doubt. Now, there's only two flowers, really, plus a bush. So, um, the only two flowers I actually grow in there are this one's here, the coneflower and uh, the aloe. And the blueberry bush seeds. We have 54 that we'll be putting those on top. Pretty much needed. I need rocks for my fireplace. Rocks for my fireplace. Alright, five. That lizard's like taunting me, wasn't he? He was tying up to this going between our feet, going, hey, how you doing, eh? Alright, let's see what we can do here. I always had a couple in there, not to uh, do them all, that's for sure. Everybody needs a fireplace. Okay, so this is, we try and change seeds. You see on top left, it says E. And those will be those seeds. If I press R, it switches to aloe. Those are aloe. Uh, and that is what? I guess those are blueberry plants. All right, hopefully those are blueberry plants. I'd really love to fill this pouch up because now we are empty. Now we are empty. Hopefully that's going to happen. It'll be really cool of them to get that done. I'll fix up that afterwards. Oh, so close. So close, yet so far. So bad, not so bad right now. This is kind of off. Now again, the updates, if you guys are new and to this, the updates can be pushed by at least one day. I've never seen them go any further one day. Uh, sometimes they do last minute kind of things and they, they want to they wanna wait before launching and that's fine for testing. I don't mind an extra day. But again, I've never seen longer one day. So if you're looking forward to it, it'll be gone. That's going to grow really nicely. I think it's going to look nice overall if we can actually do that with a path. Uh, but again, we'll figure out how this all works out afterwards. Maybe make another one in here and we'll figure out the look, the complete look of this. It'll be really nice. All right, guys, we'll leave the episode here. And when we come back, we'll be at a brand new update and we will be... Oh, can I climb on this? Oh, so sweet. It's like... That is, that is pretty freaking cool. And we'll try to... Uh, I thought I saw something way over there. And we'll, we'll be discussing a brand new update. Sorry, and it'll be really awesome. I can't wait to, to actually see what they're going to bring out to us. So thank you so much for being here again. You guys are absolutely, absolutely awesome. This is the Edge from Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.